I, I stopped this on the other DS. I switched the DS. The, the DS is out and the cords on the DS is so let's see if <clears throat> this one makes my voice let's see if this one makes my voice all funky and sounding like I'm all drugged out I sound so drugged up and drugged up and everything you keep doing that you keep changing my voice and making it sound like I'm blah blah blah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, that's you. you cold? No, you cold? Nice. You got your nice warm jackets on there. My, my legs are cold. Yeah. From the wind. From the wind. Well, well, you'll have to learn how to wear, um, Long John's like all the rest of the kids do. No, no. Bus. Here comes your bus. Mommy loves you. Mm. Mm, well, have a good day, okay? He's tired. Have a good day, big boy! Broke down there. Hi, baby. You see me watch some Star Trek with mommy? Hmm? You go watch Star Trek with mommy? Yeah. I got many, many years to make up for. I missed out so many years of watching TV and watching things with my husband or my kids, anybody. But I'm, I'm going to make up for it now. All by myself, but... All by myself, but still. Obviously, I can't do the extracurricular stuff that I want to do, like cycle riding and going kayaking. Or actually, I don't really like to kayak, but I don't never kayaked before. But I don't think I really want to. I like to go canoeing or boating, fishing. You know. And uh, all kinds of other stuff. We'll see how it goes. something to munch on I did my dishes last night right and then all of a sudden I had like a couple plates and my son my son my son came out with a bunch of dishes I guess from coming out of his bedroom and I had a, almost a full thing all right praise God hope is in front of me and my children peace be with us what are you doing this morning I have to go to Vineland, or Millville, to the Cub Scout place. Hopefully, the shirt is only $12 there because it's only $12 online. But, I don't have the money to buy it online. Like, maybe I can just try to get my husband to put extra money. Give me extra money so I can pay for it. Uh. I can try to get my husband to do it. God forbid. I gotta pull teeth to get him to do it. Because it'd be a lot easier to get this stuff that I need online. Because it's a lot cheaper too. So we'll see what happens. I'll ask him when he comes home from work today. I'll be busy. 
between my son's got to be in work at five today so and of course marina I, i'm telling you marina better not have touched one thing in the, out of his room marina better not have ha hacked into my stuff not have had she better not had one thing of wi-fi not one wi-fi knit thing in my house because you know my son lies he, he believes everything that fucking his faggot friends tell him. He's, gonna, he's been learning everything the hard fucking way. He's been learning everything the hard way. And then saying, oh, right, Mom, you were right, Mom. Mom, you were right. And then, then two months later, he's right back to the same old fucking pattern because of these assholes and what they're doing. What these assholes done to him all these years because they're fucking losers. They had no goddamn job. And they had a record. So they had to steal my life and my kid's life because they're fucking losers. I'm going to make sure those losers can go to jail because you're nothing but career criminals. You and your family. That's all I know. That's what I've been told. So you don't know any better. So you might as well just stay career criminal. You and your whole entire fucking family can go to jail. Your mama, your daddy, your brothers, your sisters. Because your sister looks like a goddamn slut. And she dresses like one. Then you're going to friggin' judge me? I don't think so. You do that. You know who the fuck I'm talking about. Excuse my language to my brothers and sisters. My brothers and sisters in Christ. But these, pe these cr career criminals have done nothing but harm to me and my family. The father didn't work. But they had this huge, big, beautiful mansion house. You put two and two together. And I hope you's rotten hell for it. Because you ain't doing me. You're not going to mess with my family. Because you guys don't know. You didn't have shit. You keep going to Ots. Well, that's what he was doing 15 years ago. In Ots. Selling drugs and pills. My husband would steal them from the friggin friggin Amerisaurus Bergen and Frankie would go sell them. Two fucking peas in a goddamn pod. They get a job at the pharmaceutical warehouse so they can get in good with all the stuff. Steal, steal the marijuana and the cocaine out of the damn voltages. Because I worked in, I was a DEA shipping clerk. I was inside the vault inside the cage where all the narcotic stuff was I was very responsible and they wanted my job and my life so I'm glad that worked for them I'm gonna keep praising God and you are gonna go down and I'm putting two to two together between my husband's family and the ones that he recruited new recruit new recruit new recruit well I'm glad you recruited another career criminal you can cr recruit all your career criminals all you want. But those, some of those career criminals are going to turn around and get your asses for friggin' fraud. Because you were a loser and wanted my life. I will keep praising God. And trusting my Lord and Savior. And then this video better not be voice changed. You better not have changed my voice on here at all. I tell you that right now. I switched DS's so hopefully that works out. So it's probably and then this is gonna be um, probably a different number because I had to stop it and restart it. So praise be to God. Hope hope is in front of me. Peace be with us, truth be told, and Star Trek time. I've got a lot to catch up to. You know what? Obviously, I don't have nothing else better to do because I got no money or no gas to go anywhere. And that's how they like it. So the bitch can steal my life. Where are you? And what are you doing?